Welcome back to Backpack. It always feels weird saying that. Welcome back to Backpack Hero. Uh, apparently I didn't actually sell my stuff last time. I also forgot to put the box of nails in there. So thank you guys for reminding me. I actually have to click on sell items to sell the items, guys. So let's do it. And now I can probably actually build stuff. And you guys were suggesting building the library first. But I can't yet. I need more. So if I build the house, it increases population. Um, so I guess I'll go out adventuring and we'll build the library uh, after the next one. Let's go. Ooh, what style do we want to go with? I kind of like this one. And I guess I only have the, st the standard run to do? Oh, those are completed, okay. All right, it's just gonna be a standard run this time. Maybe we'll do a couple of runs. This is a, ooh. Green snails. You will get four experience for defeating this enemy. These goopy creatures make you feel sick. What's this? Four regen. Okay, so let me hit you. I'm gonna take a meal. I'm gonna use my consumables. And then we'll block this one. Because you, you, like, you get a bunch of stuff, right? I'm just going to use them up. I'm realizing you get a ton of items. Let's go... I don't know what I'm going to get, but let's go tall at first. We got a damage knife. Deals eight damage. Three uses. Okay, that's good. Grab that. Acidic Potion deals 12 damage to all enemies and then destroyed. This is new. Clean Burn. Must be played on an item. On use, removes 100% of all status effects on self. Items this is played on or destroyed, and it's destroyed. But it costs zero. Interesting. Old coin sells for 10 extra treasure. Haversack Hill. And the flower. Beak and. I think I'm gonna get the potion. I'll get the I'll get the clean bird also. See how that works out. So we've got healing, which we don't really need. So let's let's do combat first. Oh yeah, the bomb. So this would have been a reason not to, not to use that item before. Because this is a tougher fight. Um, but let's use the acidic potion. And I'll kill this guy. Eight damage. Okay. And then we can use the knife. kill them. You're just going to block. That's fine. You're going to do six damage. We can do one block. Sure. I'm going to keep using my stuff. We're just, we're trying different things, you know? If you only ever play one way, you don't learn. So I can't go any taller. So maybe next up we go... No, no, no. Let's go wide. A lot of potions. Oh, warm drink. Yes. So the uh, I I saw in a comment that you could throw the cup. That seems pretty good. Oh, reroll the combat items. If I had more weapons, I would grab this, but I don't. I like the acidic potion. Look at all these potions. Three damage to all enemies and six poison. So that's just better than this, right? I 
I guess this is considered a weapon though, so yeah. I could use the rough whetstone with that. Hmm. I need the cup though. Let's try that out. It's also is it also considered a weapon after after uh, you consume it? Okay, we still don't need to heal. Let's get the chest. Can be used one time each turn. Deals two damage. Heart ring. You get uh, bonus health. Oh, it doesn't uh, max out your health. Interesting. Debuff potion adds slow to all enemies. What does slow do exactly? We'll reduce block by X when blocking. Okay. All right. Let's go fight again and then we can heal afterwards. What are you doing? Power, cowardly. We'll flee if only cowardly enemies remain. Right, 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 right. right. Okay. Do that. One time each turn. I want the experience. Take some hits. Okay, so kill. Oh, poison sickness will not take any action. That's cool. You're gonna die. Right, you're gonna die. But I don't need to attack you. And you're just going to block. You're gonna take five damage. Cool. Does it, oh, does it go through? Yeah, it goes through the block, eh? Doesn't matter. Ooh, what's this? Spike shield? Shove shield. That's seven block. Pushes frontmost enemy to the back of the group. I'm not really noticing an order important so far with the enemies, but maybe that'll change. But... Do I want two shields? This is smaller, too. Oh, yeah, the keys. <laughs> I just don't know what those do. Another cup. So we can grab the whetstone now. So it'll, it'll buff all of those. I like how it highlights the things it's going to buff. Spikes. That's good. Uh, yeah, I'm fine with this. Let's go heal and do the uh, special encounter, which is the, yeah, the patrol. Can definitely take a better weapon. Ah, ninja star. Okay. So now we've got uh, four weapons that can be buffed with the whetstone. But on the next level, we're ripping through this. I'm getting better at the game, so things are moving faster. Ah, uh, we got some food. Merchant. Let's go to the merchant afterwards. Uh, I guess I could have bought a better weapon. Holy Sheboygan. Okay, these guys are getting tough. Do slow and weak. Let's do the whetstone. Oh, he's doing zero da- Oh, they're doing zero damage now. Oh, I didn't notice that. So that's what weakness, is, weakness does, right? Huh, okay, okay. 
Well, I used it. Are you sure can in this row or column plus one damage? Okay. I'll wait on that then. Oh, and they're going to take damage just from attacking me too. Yeah, because of the because of the throws. You're doing nine damage. Okay. Kill you. We'll do a block. Zero and one. Okay. So now I can use the warm drink to heal for 10. And then we have, oh, now that's considered a weapon. Okay. You're gonna hit me for 10. This guy's tough. I can throw it for six and then it's destroyed. Okay. Time to die. That was a pretty tough fight. We can't go high. Let's go wide again. Oh, you can go really wide. Here we go. More throwing stars. So, these are all shurikens also. For each shuriken in this row or column, plus one damage. That doesn't buff it though, because it's not. Di uh, this doesn't buff things that are diagonally adjacent. Same thing with the cleavers, right? This is a poison star. Deals nine damage, but it's destroyed afterwards. Um, would be good getting the hard hat though, so maybe, oh, hazard below, I don't have any hazards. It only adds one block every turn. I still think that's probably better than like, yeah, let's do this. So we got a chest of valuables, that's money. Let's go to the chest of valuables. We got a club. Let's grab all this stuff. And get the money. Now I can go to the merchant. I could sell stuff. Ooh, the cloud sword. Oh, I love the cloud sword. 35. Club does nine damage and then adds a week. Plus one to the energy cost for this turn. Oh, it costs an extra energy to use it. It's only worth three. I definitely want this. Or the machete. Deals three damage to all enemies. Oh, I can get I could get those as well. Hmm, tough choices. I like the shiv also. It's free. I don't think I'm going to use this very often. I'm going to sell it.
Guardian Band. On take, damage adds two haste, so more, more block, excuse me. It's a fire star also, so it adds more damage to this. It's kind of the build that we're going for. Uh, I need five more. I'm gonna sell. I can't, why isn't this working? Here we go. I'm gonna sell these and I'm gonna buy the cloud sword. Economics! <laughs> yeah, that's right. And this fire star costs one. These cost six. So if I move this here, I can put the fire star there. And now it does 10 damage. I can come back to. What are you trading? Different item of the same rarity. I kind of like what we have. Yeah, I think we're good. I want to see what this event is. What a sucker, I didn't trade it. Oh no. A single flower upon his chest. The possum has been here for several days, poor fellow. Steal from the body? Pray for him? You kneel to pray for him. He opens a single eye. Nobody has ever done anything nice for me before, he says. You aren't here just to loot me? He gives you a gift and then lays back down. Another ninja star? Okay, so it has to be... Row or column. So I could move this here. Oh, and this is the same thing. Okay, 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 okay. I gotta, th I gotta think about this for a second. I guess I could... No, 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 I want this to be in the same row as that, though. Well, it's one or the other, I guess, right? That's pretty cool. Yeah, I think this is the best configuration I can think of right now. Creates goo in adjacent spaces. I don't like that at all. But this guy is going to... Oh, I don't really need money, to be honest with you, so I'm not too concerned about that. Well, I can use this. Oh, right, I wanted to put the wet zone next to that, too. I'm cool with using this right now and then using the kunai. I use one of these. Sure. Okay. I right, take some hits. There we go. Let's get me my money. Oh, regen. That's okay. Oh, you're gonna poison, di poison to death. It kind of didn't consider that. Heavy blade. Six damage, add slow to all enemies on kill. Ah, <laughs> got to pick up my ninja star. And another rough whetstone. Oh, I like the meal. Definitely gonna take the meal. And another ninja star.
That's awesome. So you got experience? Healing? And then... Oh, this event... Yeah, we, we did this, right? Let's go! The finale. Nothing but the boss. Queen Bee. Get 20 experience to defeat this enemy. The Queen Bee commands the armies. We'll summon an enemy. So probably we want to kill them as quickly as possible. Boss. <laughs> that goes without saying. I love when I say something totally obvious. Um... Well, let's use all of the stuff we have. Rip. That's what we're here to do. I should have used the whetstone first. That was not at all. I shouldn't have bothered using the whetstone because the extra turn uh, with the cloud sword uh, would have done more damage. Well, I destroyed them. I guess the reason not to use these is to keep them for selling, but also for uh, research later on. Easy. Jeez, yeah. All right, so maybe I'm not going to do multiple runs because I should be able to build some stuff now. Oh, and everyone wants to talk. Oh, there's more people. King Stug. Oh, the famous purse. Have we met? No, dear girl, but King has heard of your exploits in the dungeon. You are taking treasures that rightfully belong to him. Everything in the dungeon beneath Odaria belongs to King. But without it, we wouldn't even... Silence! This will be your only warning. If we see you again in the dungeon, the consequences will be severe. Our armies will eradicate this pathetic place. Don't try to be a hero. But I'm literally the backpack hero. What do you think, Mayor Quillswish? Mayor Mayor Killswish? I need a place to stay, and what better spot than among my adoring constituents? I see you have already built a home for new voters. Increasing the population of Haversack will... Hill, Haversack Hill? I thought it said will. Hill will create new opportunities and bring new special guests. Your votes don't count without a valid address. What about Pops? Are you planning to go back into the dungeon again? You know, you know I am. And I can't talk you out of it. You can't. I can't stop you from going, but maybe I can encourage you to go with some armor? Yeah! Spiked helmet, liquid armor, knight's armor, and wooden sword. Ah, uh, new quest. Okay, cool. We get Lost Spark. Cornucopia. Sure, Dad. You should have given that to me before. Towns aren't just about buildings. They're all about how you organize things. I think we could sell even more stuff if we had some proper decorations around our store. Try these. A crate. <laughs> Commercial thing. Yeah, it's beautiful. Uh, and some of these could help too. A pot. The pot, some pot could help. Place these adjacent to the store. They'll draw in some more customers. In build mode, if you hover over the store, you should see any nearby decorations highlighting green. I'll think of more ways to drive business soon. Uh, Miss Burrow. She can teach you anything you need to know. Hazel? Purse? I remember you from school. You were just starting around the time I graduated. That's me, I always thought you were so cool. Everyone always loved me at the old schoolhouse before it burned down. That's why I became a teacher. Now, if only we had a schoolhouse. Could you build one? 
Hell yeah, for each commercial decoration you're buying plus 5% efficiency. I know you can do it, after all, you're a bit of a celebrity around here now, and that backpack isn't slowing you down one bit. Thighs are killing me. Well, if you ever need a break from all that collecting, stop on by, I can teach you all kinds of things. If you ever feel confused or lost, a little education will fix you right up. What can I teach you about today? Teach me about Haversack Hill. It's the safest, coziest place in all of Ordaria. There's always more to do here. What did you want to know about? Oh, the history. What can I teach you about Haversack Hill? Um, where is it? <laughs> Who built Haversack Hill? Your mom was the founding member. And of course, there was Lord Quillswish, the original mayor. He could raise an army with a single speech. And a young little me had quite the crush on that dashing lad. His son is okay, too. Yeah, I don't know about that. Uh, what happened here? It happened when you were just a little kid, and I was barely old enough to help run my dad's old fruit stand. Your mom, Prada. Oh, yeah. Someone pointed out in a comment that uh, our dad's name is Louis, like Louis Vuitton. Our name is Purse, and her mom's name is Prada. I think that's hilarious. Um, your mom, Prada, was worried about something and ran off just before sundown. A few hours later, we saw the flicker of flames and the smell of burning wood. Kingsmen. They had been seen raiding villages across the forest, taking every able-bodied animal and conscripting them to the army. You were so strong and efficient. As soon as it started, it was over. My mom and dad were taken, and so was every other adult I knew. Mayor Lord... <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Mayor's dad, Mayor Quillsmith's father, his first name was Lord? Or... Mayor Lord Quillsmith was old then, and he tried his best to keep the town together. But when he died, that last glimmer of hope went with it. But then you found that backpack and things started to go right again. I hope we can rebuild this place. As it expands, we learn more about the world around us and the dungeon beneath us. Uh, what about the dungeon? It's huge, stretching beneath all of Ordaria. Ever shifting and ancient beyond our time. What can I teach you about the place? The history. There's a lot we still don't know about that place, but I'll explain what I can. Who built it? It's been around for as long as anyone can remember. It's older than all the kingdoms in Nordaria, and possibly even older than that. Some scholars theorize that an old forgotten civilization built it. But who were these mysterious animals? What happened to them? And why did they make the hallways shift so much? Didn't they get lost? So many mysteries. Can we destroy it? Destroy it? Why would we want to? Dungeon has given us everything. Every scientific and technological breakthrough in history has been connected to the dungeon. It also provides us with seemingly limitless resources. We need that place. Who goes there? Who goes there? Adventurers of all sorts explore those dark hallways. Sometimes it's for the thrill. But also, couriers bring back the supplies we need to survive from that place. Those that carry backpacks are the true heroes. Guess that's it for now. Smart young girl. Matthew, an explorer who has seen the depths of the dungeon. I see you've returned from the dungeon. As have I. Yes, it's true, you are not the only one who explores those depths. Ah, waits you on standard runs in the dungeon. He gives you items to help you get started. Oh, I thought that might be a new adventure. Perhaps I will meet you down there. I might be able to give you a few pointers. I'm also looking for lost sparks. Have you heard about these mysterious sources of energy? We can use them to open new depths in the dungeon. That's exactly what I need. I've been trying to get deeper in the dungeon. I think my mom might be trapped down there. She disappeared in a raid. Same one that ruined the old town. Mm, yes, we need lost sparks to find those who are lost in the deep dark depths beneath Odaria. What we need is an adventurer who can brave the depths and find these lost sparks. And we need to get some more villagers here. 
We'll need all the information we can get. Finding lost sparks won't be easy. Let me show you some of the things we can research together. If you're interested, of course. There are still more areas to unlock. You have lost sparks for me? Aha. Key to the deep caves. Uh, I see you are becoming an experienced explorer already. You've brought back lost sparks. We can use them to fashion keys. Hmm, yes, I know all about these magical relics. They're so small, you can just slip them in your pocket. They won't even take any space in your backpack. Find the staircase that leads down deeper into the deep caves. Aha! Beneath the crypts, a strange rocky area holds many secrets. New area unlocked. Use the key to unlock the door! You think my mom is down there? Perhaps, but continue to collect lost sparks. There are many areas deeper still. Be warned, the dangers are great. I think we I think we talked to everybody. Okay, um Pardon me. <laughs> Excuse me, Dad. Can I build uh and build crates and stuff? Schoolhouse. I'm a little short on the library, but I wanna build it. Oops. Uh don't wanna destroy that. So wait, 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 wait. Well, I definitely want to sell this. What did I need? 50? So I need nine more? Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> okay, nine. That's one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Nine? Bandages? Sure. Wait, what? Oh, they only have 30? I can't count. Um, sh well, shoot. I do want to build it, but I guess I have to do one more run, maybe? Or do I just sell all the stuff? Oh, I didn't sell. Oh, I'm a dummy. You gotta click that button. Okay, we can move this, this stuff around later, so I'll just place it here for now. I wish you could build roads and stuff. Learn power, learn about powerful relics here for each commercial decoration nearby plus 5% efficiency. How much is it for this stuff? Three. So three for a pot, ten hammers, and ten cheese for a crate. Ah, okay. So red we need a red cotton to find to unlock fluffy cotton. Little ice cream to unlock ice cream. Little red root to unlock big spicy ginger. Little red tusk to unlock tusk. Okay. So now I know what I'm after. House is 20, farm is 20. Okay, I think I'm gonna wrap up this episode here and we'll uh, do that quest next time and see if we can find the lower level dungeon. See how that all works out. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you on the next one and I love you all.